Hello everybody, this is Tricolor Chudoi and this is a gameplay in the background of a free for all on rundown on Modern Warfare 2. Um, I do pretty decent in this video, I'm not sure how many kills and deaths I get but that will be in uh, very soon. Uh, this is my first ever video to be submitted to Fraser Games. I've put one on Fraser Recruits if that one's been uploaded yet, which it probably should have. And that was just a pretty much introduction to me really, just saying I'm new and I'll be doing all this on phase of games. Um this isn't a series. Again, it's just like it's like a mini introduction. I'm not gonna be it's not gonna be all introduction. I'll commentate the game. Um and I'll have I've got all sorts of other games to be playing on phase of games. Um if there's any Halo fans out there, uh, obviously Call of Duty fans, I'll keep this up. And I'm not limited to Xbox, I could play anything if you wanted me to. So I'd love um Comments in in the video tell me what you'd like to see, and if I have the game, I'll get that recorded for you and commentated, and put it up as soon as possible. Um, I've only been on Phase a day now, and the support and everything, it's great. Um, I can't wait to see this up on the channel. Um, if you want to go and check out my channel, my personal channel, it's uh, Tricolor Tudor. You'll probably be in the description. That's got um, loads of games on. Uh, if you just want to go on got any free time, just wanna and uh I don't know what to say really. Uh what's it called? Right where there. Um Kill Time. If you just wanna kill time, go and have a look at some of my videos. I had seven hundred videos and then I deleted five hundred of them simply because they weren't doing as well as I wanted them to. So now I have two hundred videos, two hundred and something videos, which are all doing pretty well. Um, I've got a decent channel, so I hope you go and check it out. And enough with my channel. This is a uh, phase of games. Like I say, I'm I'm a new director. I think I was only no, it wasn't yesterday. It was the day before I got air thinged, and um, the date today is so you get an idea. It is the 15th of August, so on the third, the ninth of night of the 13th of August is when I got directed. I applied. They commented on one of my videos. I went on Skype, they talked me through the whole thing, sent me all the the banners and stuff. And that was that really. I got uploading and I got uh recording. So I'm a bit nervous because um I have no idea how many people I'm gonna be talking to. Because um it's definitely gonna be a lot more than what I do on uh, my channel. Because I have nearly four hundred and fifty subscribers on my channel. Yet hardly any of them watch them watch my videos frequently it's not like I get 300 videos per video I I don't think I've ever done that I ever will for a very long time so depending on how many people watch this video we'll just have to wait and see and I could do like I said I could do anything just tell me in the comments what you think I could play any Halo fans any Call of Duty fans any I don't know first person shooter fans tell us that any racing game fans I could play uh, car games if you want to just do just anything you wanted really and that guy failed at trying to get me but um this is a really strange one because if I remember rightly in this game I'm tired at the moment but I do really bad and then I think I don't know for some reason I'm remembering a uh, AC-130 slash chopper gunner but I, I don't even think I've got that on because I remember making a massive comeback because I am, I'm losing and then I come up and win the game. So we'll have to wait and see for that as well. Also Black Ops 2 is coming out. Um, the same goes for Black Ops 1 and Modern Warfare 3. Um, I was really not that bothered about it. Because I, I said to myself, right, I'm going to just keep away from it. It doesn't look good. Modern Warfare 2 was the best one for me, and World at War. Um, I went out and got Black Ops. I crumbled and just went, oh, it looks good, all my friends have got it. Let's go and get it. But Black Ops was bad, apart from the zombies. If it didn't have zombies, it would be a very bad game. I mean, I love zombies. The storyline and everything just goes brilliant. I just find it really good. Modern Warfare 3. Um didn't want that. Started to look good in the trailers as they always do. 
And then I said to myself, right, I liked Modern Warfare 1, I liked Modern Warfare 2, why don't I try 3? So there we go, I've crumbled on Modern Warfare 3, and um, I went out and bought that. Didn't like it at all. Uh, survival and Spec Ops, never touched a mission on Spec Ops, survival isn't exactly my favourite thing. And now it's um, Black Ops 2. Uh, when I first heard about Black Ops 2, when I first watched the trailer, uh, the bit where they're flying around in those things and it's like all futuristic. Already I was liking it. I think I was the only one in my class at the time who was liking it. Because everybody thought, no, horses, future, what the hell. But uh, for some reason I like the future. I like, I mean obviously it's not laser guns, but anything like that. But I like how it kind of imitates what it's going to be like in the future. So that would be pretty cool. So... I immediately like that. Um, I've been waiting on trailers. The trailers are all looking good. Obviously there's going to be some overpowered guns. I saw... Maybe it's called a Ballistica. I don't know if you've heard of that gun. It's like a sniper rifle without a scope. It's got like a foul. Uh, like imagine a foul on this game, Modern Warfare 2. It's got that type of aim. But it's a sniper. So it's one shot kill. All you have to do is aim, shoot, dead. So that is going to be overpowered and overused as hell. And I can say that because I'll probably be using it. And the other guns look really good. Um, kill streaks look decent. I, I don't understand how the RCXD is in there. Because somehow the RCXD has gone from Vietnam to 2025. And not once was it in Modern Warfare. Any of the Modern Warfares. So it's just like gone out of service for those... 40 years, whatever it is. <coughs> so, yeah, they're looking good. I'll, I'll probably be definitely be getting Black Ops 2. If not for the multiplayer and the campaign, which looks good anyway, the zombies. I am dying to see the zombies. Uh, there's been no trailer, no massive news about the zombies yet. I'm dying to find out about it. I love the storyline, like I said. Um, the maps are supposed to be massive now on the Black Ops 2 and the 4v4 mode. Which I believe is about... Now this is my look on it. It's probably obvious to most people. But at first I didn't really click on. So this is what I think of the 4v4 now. What's going to be is two teams of four obviously. And I don't know how it's going to be. Are they going to be on... Like separate... Are they going to be on the same map but you're not going to be able to see each other in the game? Or are they going to be in the game but can't show each other or something? Because <coughs> I'm thinking... Like... Say everybody on your team dies, that's your little friend's competitive match over. And then you just have to sp uh, spectate the other team while they just ha play for fun to try and get some more rounds on top. So it's pretty much, it's going to be a competitive little game where you can see who can survive the longest. And what I think is going to happen there is, this is a little idea for you guys, is get um, <coughs> for your mates and make a clan. I thought this out last night, I think I'm the only one who thought this out. But uh, if you think about teams in zombies, that's going to start clans. Zombie clans. Professional zombie players. You get where I'm coming from? So, oh he's that chubby gonna. I, I thought I had something. But yeah, I thought that'd be a good idea for people to get started. Um, you could challenge other people online if this is how it's actually going to work. If it doesn't work like I just said, the 4v4, um, you're a bit screwed, but chances are it will. So there's that. And another thing, most of the Call of Duty fans don't like Halo, so if you're watching this you might not like Halo, but I'm going to talk about a little bit about Halo 4. Um, Halo 4, I'm looking really forward to that. Um, I've been waiting on Halo 4 for a very long time since Halo 3. ODST was a bit of a letdown. Halo Reach was good, I'd say very good. Um, I love the ranking up system on Halo Reach. Hated it on Halo 3. I bet there's a lot of people who agree with me on that one. I'm not sure how the Halo 4 ranking system works, but it's looking decent-ish. I like how you can customise the your Spartan, that's my main thing. And there we are. I made a massive comeback, and I'm at top. 30 kills and only 16 deaths. Well, I'm saying only 16 deaths, that's not the best. But still, I came back with the chopper gun and got me Harry, and there we are. Harry got the last kill. So anyway, thanks for watching this, guys. I'm the new to Phaser. Uh, leave a like, and be sure to watch the rest of my videos.